So these antagonistic signals, these alarms that are sent to us, are being sent at our request to provide us with information that we need to navigate. They are irritating because we have refused to pay attention to them. See, they're howlers. When you don't open up the envelope, it starts to scream and smoke and, and it will embarrass you in front of whoever is present when the howler arrives. And they seem to always arrive at mealtime when the entire community is gathered. Open that letter as soon as you get it because it only gets worse. The longer you wait, the worse it gets. And if you manage to master the howler and immediately say, you're right. I release it. No pain, no foul. Bam. It takes practice, but it's, a, it's the goal. Mia Copia. I know I did it. Mia Copia. What is my wrong in this situation? Mia Copia? What's my part in this? Pull it out. Drop it in the pensive and allow it to stir the waters and watch the movie that plays. You want my stick? That's my wand. You got my magic wand. Give it back. I'm over to the dark side. Boop, boop, sha, boop. Come over to the dark side. Woo, woo, dee, loop. Come over to the dark side. Woo, woo, woo. Come over to the dark side. What you gonna do? Come over to the dark side. Yes, I'm talking to you. Boop, boop, sha, boop, woo, woo. They don't actually burst into flames at the end. If you never ever listen, they just keep going in the background of your mind and you find a way to put them in the file where all that stuff is and you assign larger and larger parts of your mental circuitry to not hearing the screaming howlers in the closet. But that's just a credit plan. I mean, one way or another, that information is going to get through. Come over to the dark side, well, oh, well, oh, well. Come out of the sun, burning in hell, hell, hell. You're burning alive, my dear, you know it's true. Scared of all the things you've done, woo. It's safer on the dark side. Baby, please don't run, do, do not run, do, do, do not run. The collective power of all, of all those howlers in the closet. Here's what they've made for us. They have made a picture of corporate entities controlling our world who are insane and hell-bent on destruction. That's the picture we have playing on the big screen. Now what does that mean? It means that the fact that we hate it and it makes us sick and causes us unimaginable pain and anguish does not mean in any way that this is different than all the other data out there. This is a representation of what we are doing. Every single one of us or we wouldn't still be in this world. We need to be able to enter into the mind of the one who is our nemesis. because otherwise we will never understand ourselves. Because this enemy we perceive as being out there, hunting us, is in here, trying to find the light. Because it in fact only exists within our own resistance to the story we are in fact telling ourselves for our own benefit. Come over to the dark side, boop, boop, sha, boop. Come over to the dark side, whoop, whoop, dee loop. Come over to the dark side, whoop, whoop, whoop. Come over to the dark side, what you gotta do? Come over to the dark side. This is your story too, boop, boop, sha, boop, whoop, whoop, dee loop. It's that thing we put in the basement because it was so disturbing. 
and this is the particular pathology of America, that we have made an idol, a false god of liberty and individualism by turning into a devil and an enemy the last failed experiment in corporate being. We have arrived at our present location. I'm talking about communism. Communism. Now over on the dark side, well, oh, well, oh, well, we got the shade come out of hell, hell, hell. Hey, iced tea and cookies, I'll take care of you. And a pitcher of lemonade, woo. You'll find me on the dark side. In the prison you made, you got it made, you got it made in the shade. See, it began as exactly what we're feeling right now as we face the corporate overlords. But because communism moved into power, holding on to the judgment against the kings, it was from the beginning setting a destination for, I will be king. Because the defining statement of the system was, you're not my king. Which includes within it the supposition that there will be a king. And if I don't have one, then I gotta be one. And I will behave the way I think a king behaves, which is the way that person who I wanted to get rid of behaved. And then I will become someone who needs to be gotten rid of, and the cycle continues. That's the power of judgment. That's the power of your decisions in this place. That's why we call it good. Come over, 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 Red Rover, Red Rover, send my heart back over. If you accept this parameter of the simulation, if you accept this aspect of life, if you accept that darkness is in fact a feature of the light and not an opposing force, you will really smoke this game.